Hello friends. Today I would like to show you one year old seedlings of Borsera microphylla. The small leaf variety of American, South American frankincense. These two plants are siblings. This one grew for a whole year of its life in semi-shade. This one, when it was just a few months old, I put out of perlite into regular growing medium like you usually grow cactuses and succulents in onto sunshine. As you can see this one is much more thick and much more branchy than this one. I don't think that the main reason why this one is so much thicker and branchier than this one. I don't think the main reason is that this one is in a original sprouting medium perlite and this one is in more regular soil. I think the main or perhaps only reason is that this one was in full sun which is natural for desert plants. So, I guess today I'm gonna move this one on sunshine too. Yes, rooster, I know you are agreeing with me. On another related subject, Borsera microphylla is very hard to grow from seed. Many, many seedlings die on beginning as opposed to my other variety of Borsera, which is Borsera faragiodes. Here is how the seedling look. I just planted wherever and it just grows. The first leaves are very, the sprouting leaves are very similar to Borsera microphylla, but then the real leaves are much larger. This is how they look. The seedlings of a the seeds of a Borsera microphylla, I have to baby a lot and still only about one out of ten survives the child, childhood, early babyhood. Let me show you. Here they are and you can see already this one is dying in this tray. Two are still alive, but many already died. In this tray, only one or two cling to life. In this tray, only one is surviving still. In this tray, none of them. Every two weeks lately, I was planting one tray, and uh, as, as the seeds ripen and my old one and uh, this is the result here are the oldest seedlings of this year and four survived this one already has a real leaves this one is dying so that's why I super treasure the two 
one year old that are healthy and growing. This is the mother plant. You see, it still has plenty of seeds that are gradually ripening. But I'll be lucky if I get one or two plants out of it. The leaves are very sparse because in February, because in winter it's too cold for borseras here, so they lose either all or most of their leaves. Also, I think the plant is wasted having so many seeds. That might be another reason. Okie dokie. Goodbye, my friends. That's all I was going to show you for today. The effect of light on seedlings of Borsera. Microphila, small leaf American frankincense. And until next time, goodbye.